is the largest aircraft in the world. Makers boasted that they had created a new breed of hyper-efficient aircraft. In a world where the movement of goods shapes economies and industries, a tale of transport unfolds across the American landscape. From the high skies to the deep seas, from the thundering rails to the sprawling highways, each mode of transportation vies for its place in the intricate dance of logistics. But amidst this symphony of speed and cost, one question beckons. Is there a third option? A golden mean between the swift soar of planes and the steady crawl of ships? As the wheels of innovation turn, could there be a new path forged? Where efficiency meets affordability, transforming the very fabric of global trade? As we delve deeper into the intricate web of transportation logistics, it becomes evident that the movement of goods within the United States is a complex interplay of speed, cost, and efficiency. Eli Dorado's insightful analysis sheds light on the diverse array of options available to shippers, each with its own set of trade-offs and considerations. Expanding upon Eli Dorado's thought-provoking analysis, it's clear that the movement of goods within the United States is a finely tuned symphony of speed, cost, and efficiency. Air transport, while the fastest option, commands a premium that limits its use for all but the most urgent shipments. Conversely, shipping by sea offers a slower but more economical alternative, making it the preferred choice for bulk cargo. Rail transport emerges as a compelling middle ground, boasting faster speeds than ships and lower costs than airplanes. This balance positions railways as a cornerstone of domestic freight, facilitating the efficient movement of goods across vast distances. However, it's the ubiquitous presence of trucks that truly underscores the adaptability and versatility of the American logistics landscape. Despite their slower speeds compared to planes and higher costs relative to ships, trucks reign supreme due to their unparalleled accessibility and door-to-door -door service. In essence, they represent the Goldilocks option, just fast enough and just cheap enough to dominate the market. Shifting focus to international trade, the contrast between air and sea freight presents a similar conundrum. While air transport offers unparalleled speed, its exorbitant costs limit its widespread use. Conversely, ocean freight, while more economical, suffers from extended transit times. This begs the question, what if there were a third option? A solution that marries the speed of air transport with the affordability of sea freight? Such an innovation could revolutionize global trade, offering a viable alternative to the existing binary choice. You will agree with me that the concept of airships as the trucks of the sky presents a tantalizing possibility for revolutionizing international freight transport. This is because, by offering swift transit times, comparable to airplanes and significantly lower costs than traditional ocean freight, airships could emerge as a game changer in the realm of global logistics. The key advantage lies in their unique mode of propulsion. Unlike planes, which rely on burning jet fuel to generate lift, airships harness the buoyancy of lighter-than-air gas to stay aloft, resulting in drastically reduced emissions. Modern airship manufacturers estimate potential emission reductions of up to 90% compared to conventional aircraft, a compelling proposition in an era of heightened environmental consciousness. Moreover, the physics governing airship design provides further cause for optimism. As Eli Dorado astutely notes, the efficiency of an airship is directly proportional to its size. By increasing the size of an airship, its lift capacity can be significantly augmented while minimizing the increase in drag. This exponential relationship between size and efficiency means that larger airships boast superior lift-to-drag ratios, offering unprecedented performance advantages. To fully realize the vision of airships as the trucks of the sky, however, ambitious strides in engineering and manufacturing are necessary. Building the largest airships the world has ever seen will require innovative solutions to overcome historical limitations in payload capacity. Yet, the potential rewards are vast. Enhanced efficiency, reduced emissions, and accelerated global trade. The intricacies of airship design offer valuable insights into the feasibility and scalability of these aerial behemoths. As Eli Dorado eloquently elucidates, airships come in three main varieties, each with its own set of structural considerations. Firstly, there are blimps, characterized by their flexible hulls maintained through overpressurization. However, as blimps increase in size, the tension on their skins escalates, posing challenges in maintaining their shape. This inherent limitation prohibits indefinite scaling, 
thus limiting the potential size of blimps. The second option, semi-rigid airships, introduces structural reinforcements to alleviate some of the tension on the hull. While offering improved stability over blimps, they still encounter constraints in scaling due to the continued reliance on tension to maintain shape. Finally, rigid body airships emerged as the most promising option for the cargo market. Featuring internal structures to support the hull, these airships utilize gas cells filled with lifting gases like hydrogen or helium. Unlike their counterparts, rigid airships do not face the same scaling limitations, as the internal structure ensures shape integrity without excessive tension on the hull. Eli's proposal to construct a colossal 388-meter-long rigid airship represents a bold leap forward in the realm of cargo transport. Capable of carrying a staggering 500 tons of goods at a respectable speed of 90 kilometers per hour, this aerial titan promises to revolutionize the logistics industry. To put its capacity into perspective, it could transport the equivalent weight of two Statues of Liberty at the speed of a leisurely highway drive. Should this ambitious vision come to fruition, the proposed airship would not only be the largest aircraft ever constructed, but also a testament to human ingenuity and innovation in conquering the skies. With its unparalleled capacity and efficiency, it has the potential to redefine the boundaries of aerial freight transport, opening up new avenues for global trade and connectivity. As Eli Dorado aptly emphasizes, the potential of airships to revolutionize the cargo market extends far beyond the realm of individual vessels. To truly capture a significant share of the global freight industry, a fleet of thousands of airships would be required, tirelessly shuttling goods across the skies. Consider this, if airships were to commandeer over half of the ocean freight container market, offering competitive pricing, akin to trucks at just 10 cents per ton kilometer, the resulting revenue would surpass a staggering $650 billion annually. Such astronomical figures would catapult any company into the upper echelons of global commerce, surpassing titans like Apple, Amazon, or Walmart in revenue. However, despite the immense potential, the reality remains that no company has yet embarked on the monumental task of building these airborne leviathans. The vision of a fleet of airships dominating the skies, transforming global logistics, and reshaping the business landscape remains tantalizingly out of reach. Yet. Just as with any ambitious endeavor, the first step towards realizing this dream is to take action. Much like launching a business or embarking on a new venture, the journey begins with getting started. The envisioned use of the Airlander 10, crafted by the UK-based company Hybrid Air Vehicles, encompasses a diverse array of applications spanning both commercial and humanitarian realms. Initially designed as a versatile cargo transport solution, the Airlander 10 boasts the capacity to carry substantial loads over long distances with unparalleled efficiency. From transporting heavy equipment to remote construction sites to delivering vital supplies to disaster-stricken areas, the Airlander 10 offers a flexible and cost-effective alternative to traditional modes of transportation. Its ability to operate from unprepared surfaces further enhances its utility enabling access to regions inaccessible to conventional aircraft or ground vehicles. Beyond its cargo capabilities, the Airlander 10 also holds promise in the realm of tourism and leisure, offering passengers a unique and unforgettable aerial experience. With its spacious interiors and panoramic views, it provides a novel way to explore scenic landscapes or embark on luxury excursions. Moreover, the Airlander 10's low environmental impact coupled with its ability to operate without traditional runways, positions it as an attractive option for eco-conscious travelers and adventure enthusiasts alike. In essence, the Airlander 10 represents a pioneering leap forward in the realm of aviation, offering a versatile and sustainable solution to the challenges of modern transportation. As it navigates the skies, it embodies the spirit of innovation and exploration, heralding a new era in aerial mobility. The versatility of airships, with their ability to land on various surfaces such as grass, sand, ice, or even water, unlocks a world of possibilities for delivering goods to remote and inaccessible locations. In regions like remote villages in Canada or Alaska, where traditional modes of transportation struggle to reach, airships offer a lifeline, delivering essential supplies and support where it's needed most. Moreover, in the aftermath of natural disasters where roads, rails, and ports may be destroyed, 
Airships emerge as invaluable assets for rapid response and disaster relief efforts. With their ability to swiftly navigate to disaster-stricken areas and deliver rescue workers and supplies, airships provide a vital lifeline to those in need. Additionally, they can serve as platforms for providing essential communication services, ensuring connectivity even in the most challenging of circumstances. LTA Research, backed by Google co-founder Sergey Brin, is at the forefront of developing airship technology for disaster relief missions. Their Pathfinder 1 prototype, with its successful indoor flight tests, heralds a new era in aerial mobility. By leveraging lessons learned from these tests, LTA Research aims to build a fleet of airships capable of providing critical assistance to disaster-affected regions worldwide. Furthermore, airships offer a solution for transporting large, cumbersome, or fragile cargo that may not be compatible with traditional road transport. Items like long turbine blades, which pose challenges for ground transportation, can be effortlessly transported by airships, ensuring timely delivery to their destinations. In essence, the versatility, flexibility, and adaptability of airships make them indispensable tools for addressing the logistical challenges of today's world. Whether delivering aid to disaster zones or transporting specialized cargo, Airships hold the promise of unlocking new possibilities and reshaping the future of global transportation. As airship technology continues to evolve and mature, there remains untapped potential for these aerial marvels to revolutionize global transportation. While current endeavors focus on areas where airships possess distinct advantages, such as disaster relief and remote access, the prospect of airships becoming the trucks of the sky remains tantalizingly within reach. Indeed, the journey towards realizing this vision will be fraught with challenges and obstacles. Yet, the potential rewards are boundless. A future where airships gracefully traverse the skies, ferrying goods and passengers to destinations previously inaccessible by traditional means. While the concept may seem fantastical to some, history has shown that what was once considered impossible often becomes commonplace with time. Just as automobiles, airplanes, and smartphones have seamlessly integrated into our daily lives, there's no reason why airships cannot follow suit. As we eagerly await the dawn of this new era in aviation, one can't help but feel a sense of excitement and anticipation. The prospect of witnessing these majestic vessels roam the skies evokes a sense of wonder and nostalgia for the great airships of the past. Indeed, it's challenging to introduce a new concept to a world not yet ready for it. However, as history has demonstrated time and again, innovation knows no bounds. And when the day comes when airships dot the horizon, soaring towards the future, may we all have the opportunity to witness this marvel firsthand, to behold the beauty of progress and embark on a journey of exploration and discovery, guided by the winds of possibility. We'd love to hear your thoughts on the topic. Do you think airships should be given a chance to make a comeback? Share your opinions in the comments below. Remember to like, subscribe, and hit the notification bell to stay updated on our latest videos, exploring cutting-edge technologies and sustainable solutions. Until next time, drive safely and stay eco-conscious. Together, let's pave the way for a cleaner, brighter future. Thank you for watching. See you in our next video.